guys! Hello everybody! Hello you! Welcome to my channel, Grace Art. And today, um, we are just going to discuss about the two yarns that I bought before. And they are from Yarn and Colors. This is it. So it is the Yarn and Colors Must Have and the Yarn and Colors Favorite. So I'm just going to show you the difference between the two. And let's get started. So for this review, I used the same color and that is what they call um, color 73 or the Jade Gravel. Looks like this. I hope you can really see it. There is it. So I will use the Mercerize and the Cotton. It's the same color but different texture. If you can see it here. It's like that. Okay. So the first thing that we are going to review is the Yarn and Colors Favorite. So the Yarn and Colors Favorite is a cotton, 100% cotton yarn. It says here that this yarn is like 50 grams and it is 170 meters long or 185 yards long. Um, you can also use a 3 millimeter crochet hook with this and with the texture of this one you can really like feel that it is soft um later on i'm just going to make a little crochet on it so we can see what it looks like and how it works with crocheting but this is the texture of the yarn you can also see it there like it is uh yeah it's very um you know soft and it has this little texture here like this so if you can see that it's really hard to show it to you guys but there it's like that later i'm going to differentiate it when we when we do a, a crochet thing okay and the next thing that we have is the must-have. This one is a 100% Mercerized cotton. So, I just did a little research and it is also on my phone. It says here, Mercerized cotton is a textile finishing treatment for cellulose fabric and yarn, mainly cotton and flax, which improves dye uptake and tear strength. Reduces fabric shrinkage and imparts a silk like luster. So, with this yarn, you can also see the difference between the other one and from this one. If you will look like that. On the video, you cannot really see the di much of a difference, I think. But later, if we will compare them, you can really see the difference with this one. So this one, the must-have, is like also 50 grams, but it is 125 meters long. And with this yarn, you can use a 2 to 3.5 millimeter crochet hook or knitting needles in creating with this one. Um, what else can I say about this is that um, if you will compare them, you can really see it here that this is much more brighter and at the same time um, it is shinier than the 100% cotton so it really is like this if you will compare them or use them this is much more softer and this has like a very strong texture than this one if you're going to compare I think if you are like sens like when you have a sensitive skin, you can use both of them actually, but the cotton one is the much more, I think I will recommend using a cotton one than the Mercerize. Mercerize is also nice to use actually for your, for your, for, your, for clothes because it is also a um, very um, strong yarn. If you also touch it there, it's a very strong yarn. 
but at the same time it gives that little shine than the other one than the cotton one and if it is like what it says also on the description that it is like a silky feeling on it unlike the cotton one the cotton is not much it's not really like very silky but it is just very soft but if for me I like creating or I will I like creating a lot of amigurumis with the mercerized cotton because it gives that very um, you know um, strong feel to the thing that you are going to make so if I will make an amigurumi I think I will recommend using the mercerized cotton and if you are going to make something for your using for your skin I think it is nice to use the 100% cotton. So that is what I can say about this two um, yarn. So these are the two yarn again. The must have and the favorite. And with this review, we are going to use the 3mm crochet hook. And this one is from Clover. It looks like this. Look at length it looks like that okay so the first thing that we are going to make or we're going to review is the yarn and colors favorite just gonna put there and I'm just gonna make like 10 chains just to compare both yarn so let's compare them let's go make 10 chains so it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. It looks like this. Ten. And let's chain ten chains also from the yarn and colors must have. So, um, this slip knot and then this chain also like 10 chains with this one so it's like one two three four five six seven eight nine and ten and it looks like this so if you will compare them both the um the favorite and the must have their length are actually just like the same like this looks like that but you can see the difference between the two this one the must have is much more brighter and you can really see the drills on it and with the cotton it is much more lighter and you cannot really see the um, you know the drills like this one this one the, has the brighter texture than the other one also even though they are the same um, um, name of yarn, you know, the color of yarn is almost, it's almost the same, but it, it is really, there's really a difference between the two. Okay, so I'm just going to check on the end, just to let, just to show you what it looks like. There, if you will just um, look at it. It's, it's, it's just like that, so you cannot really see a lot of difference between the two but you can really see that the must have is like treated than the cotton one because you can see here like this one you can see um much more fiber out of the strand and this one is much more like intact to each other so that is what I can say about these two brands of yarn.
So guys, that is my yarn review for today about these two yarns, the yarn and color favorite and the yarn and colors uh, must have the difference between the 100% cotton and the mercerized cotton. I hope that I gave you a clear impression of what it is and for your next project on what you can use on your next project. So yeah, that's actually everything what I can say about this yarn. So guys, if you enjoyed my video, please don't forget to subscribe and like and share it with your friends. And again, thank you again for watching and I see you next time. Bye-bye!